Another gadget you may want to add to your page is a list of links that you may be using with your students on a regular basis. So I'm going to um, go back into the design view and I'll click on the layout option and I'm going to add a gadget here and the one I'm looking for is a links gadget link list. So I'll click on the plus button and I will title this class links and I'll say sort them alphabetically and now I want to add in my site so that I want them to have access to. So I'll put on my school board and I need to finish that by clicking add a link. If I want to have a Google search add the link. Um, we use Google Docs a lot so I'll say uh, Google Drive and add that link and I can certainly change the order of these things if I want by simply moving them up and down through the list here using these little arrows. I click Save and then I save my arrangement I'll view my blog and I can see that the class links are now here and they're active. If I want to come back and add another link at some point all I need to do is click on the edit button and add a new link. Click on add the link it will appear at the top. I'm going to move it down to the bottom and save that and now it is active on my blog. If I want to change the order of these things you can see my follow by email, my translate, I may want them above the class links. I'll click on the design, go to layout and just drag the links down below the follow by email. Then click save the arrangement and you're